kind of with the development of the defense. Look like y'all made some progress last week in a lot of tough challenges. Oh uh, man, you know, we're just trying to come along week by week, day by day. You know, that's why we're out here practicing to get better just day by day, you know, getting all communication, everybody getting synced. You know, it's a process. So we're just working at it. What's Deron meant to your development over the last few games? I mean, Deron is my dog. I mean, the whole safety, the whole DB, them my dogs, man. Deron is my dog, man. Great leader, learned a lot from him. You know, instilled me with some free game, free knowledge, free nuggets. You know, he got a lot of years, man. And a great player, hell of a player. And uh, he helped me out with a lot of things. So, you know, we're just constantly growing together, you know. Like, if we, today I practice, perfect example. He seen something out there that I didn't see while I was in. And he was on the side, like, hey, hug, whoop de whoop de whoop And I'm like, okay, for sure, I'm a key to You know what I'm saying? And I'm a implement that. So, you know, we all help each other, but man. He's a great leader, a uh, great person to be in the room with. Does it help that he is like that personality-wise? Because if someone comes in and takes even just a couple series like you did last week, some vets are getting not like that all that much. And they're kind of, you know, I'm not going to help them. In fact, has that helped you that he's been so willing? To uh, yeah, for sure. You know what I'm saying? That's free, that's free game, free, like I said, free game, free knowledge, man. He, that's wisdom, you know. A man who's played that much in football, you know, and who's good at it and does what he does, you know, that's for sure helping. Yeah. When when did they tell you you would get some work last week? Um, I mean, coaching them just, you know, just like the week before, it's kind of been, you know, they just hop, you know, be ready, hop in the game, and like in the game, and I'll sub in and do my thing, so, yeah. How you stay ready when it's, you know, like, okay, we'll get to hell and go ahead and then? Um, you know, I take a lot of mental reps, you know, just be dialed in when I'm at practice, you know. The plays that I'm in, be dialed in, go and play at a time. Um, plays I'm not in, you know, I'm studying, you know, at the same time, and I'm just dialed in and focused on every rep. That could be in all phases, even on special teams. Mm -hmm. Just learning co consistently and constantly, so yeah. To that end, you know, going from watching you last year to this year, it does kind of seem like the game has slowed down. In, in what areas do you think like that's most evident? Um, I don't. I mean, I pay attention to myself, of course, and my growth. Um, I just, you know, do you know do a lot of studying. Um, you know, did, I mean, of course, you know, me being here for a year and stuff like that. You know, I got the little things down. You know, routine. I'm still growing in that. Just a lot of little things. You know, comfortability in the environment. You know, it came into a whole different environment and. Um, you know, I just embrace that and, you know, I just push myself, you know, day by day to just get better and, you know, the results are the results and I'm continuing, you know, to, to better myself. You talked about, I'm sorry, no, no, I was just going to go off of that, you know, this, a lot of guys say, like, the jump that you make from year one to year two is, like, well, it, it's where you want to be, like, it's what you want to see is a significant jump and I was just curious, like, do you feel that way when you're out there playing? Um, like, do you feel a jump? I mean, you know, I feel, I feel the hard work I put in, but I'm just about consistent growth. So, like, you know, I can feel that, but, you know, we're about winning. You know, I want to win in my team. So, you know, I'm doing whatever it takes for me to win, for, for me to win to help my team win. So, handling my 111, my square, with my responsibility, what I got to do to help my teammates win. And, you know, the better I do that, the better I can help the squad win. You talked about just uh, the impact that a veteran like Deron Harmon has on you. Yeah. but. Like Tori said, going from year one to year two and now having a legend like Dean Pease, how has his philosophy, his scheme, just his approach helped you to just take that jump that much quicker? Helped me out a lot too, man. That's another coach that's just been through it all, man. And uh, I learned a lot from him, you know. We'll have like little side talks on the side, on the sideline, or I'll sit through the hallway, you know. He'll give me some, like I said, some free game, knowledge on, hey, you could do this a little bit better. If we in this, you could come this way. You know, stuff like that, that I just take and just add it to my toolbox and I'll just learn, you know? So that's what we did. Can What's you give it? us maybe one thing that he's helped you to add to the toolbox? Work hard. <laughs> <laughs> work harder. Work hard, but work harder. I can't get on those figures, but yeah. What are you, we'll go back to Deron with the same What is one example of what Deron has told you? I don't know, you just watch a film of him after practice, or that, that you're like, wow, I didn't see that in my game, that I wasn't doing, that you could change. Um, just, it could, it's just be like the slightest things, the things that a lot of players won't think about. Um, you know, for example, maybe some down and distance stuff, you know, just little awareness stuff and tips like that. You know, I mean, I could get specific and that would be a long list of things, but I'll just give you guys some broad, so stuff like that. Just, you know, awareness, 
um, knowing when you're knowing where you're out on the field, stuff like that. You know, we just like know. This We're good at this specific. I know, <laughs> but I'm. You know, you know the, it, you know it's really interesting. That I didn't mean to cut you off. No worries. <laughs> it's really interesting because I feel like the secondary. We didn't know what to expect with the secondary kind of coming in because you had some guys who were here, some young guys coming in, some rookies, and also you know with Duran and Eric, they're longtime vets. It was kind of a hodgepodge of a secondary that we didn't really know what to expect. I mean, I remember talking to AJ during the training camp, and he said the word that y'all wanted was like savvy, like y'all he wanted to see y'all be savvy or something like that. Yeah, nice. I mean, what does how do you, you talk about the camaraderie of this safeties group, but just the entire secondary, like how do you feel like y'all are on that same page? Yeah, like he's saying savvy, playing out there with swag and playing savvy, like, you know, playing loose, you know, just playing with energy and just enjoying being out there, you know, embracing being out there and just being confident, you know, playing savvy like that, not playing, you know, like robots, you know, having fun with it while we're out there, just because of our preparation that we know what we're doing and we're all in the scene. You know, that's when the game is fun, so. What do you feel like, and this could be serious, it could be not, but what, what do you feel like you've learned about this group, about this secondary in the last couple of months? I learned that, you know, my boys, my dogs, they're really a hardworking group. You know, from seeing the, the extra work that we put in after practice consistently from the beginning of OTAs and the way we study, the way we come together, the attention to detail, the high effort, you know, everybody running to the ball. You know, I like where we're headed, man. We just got to just keep going. You know, I learned that about my group. Everybody, you know, we stick together even through the tough times, you know, through wins and the losses. So, yeah. Anything else? All right. Thanks, guys. Thank, Thank you. Thank y'all. Appreciate y'all. Thank y'all. Thank you.